YouTube, it is Mo again. Yeah, I'm gonna bust out these videos today. It's been a while since I did the video. And my last video, I was talking about, you know, I'm starting my new nail journey. Actually, it's a revisited nail journey because when I was starting out taking care of my nails, um, I didn't stick with it. So my nails have not grown since months ago that I posted the video. So now I'm back focused on it. Like I said, I'm not focusing on my hair anymore because I know how to take care of my hair anymore. So I don't feel that's a journey anymore. It's healthy the way I like it. It's, I know how to take care of it. I know what type of products I like to use in my hair. And it's a done deal. And I will share any new products that I, um, that I do, do um, try in my hair. But... Actually, let's talk about my nails because this is the video meant, meant for that. Now, um, a couple of weeks, I had decided to start my nail journey again, and I was trying to do the base coat, top coat thing, and for some odd reason, nail polish will not stay on my fingers, no matter what type of product I put on. I would use the Sally Hansen acrylic top coat. I use the Sally Hansen two-in-one base coat, top coat. That that's combined. I use the regular base coat. I was just trying a lot of different um, polishes, but nothing was working. I mean, my nail polish was peeling off. It wasn't even that it was chipping off. Like within, I'd say half an hour, it would be peeling off, chipping off. I started wearing plastic gloves to try to see if that was a problem, but it was still happening. So now, I'm totally focused on my nails. And um, this is basically week two that I've actually been on a constant um, routine with my nails. And I actually had to um, inbox one of the nail gurus. I think it's her, na her name is Love for Nails because um, she has a great channel. And she always mentioned about free edging, and I didn't know what that was, so I had to inbox her to ask her exactly what, what it is and she had posted a video previously about it which I couldn't find but she was very helpful and she reposted the video for me in my inbox and I was able to find out what it is and I started doing that with my nails and it still wasn't working in fact I was doing that with my nails anyway I just didn't know that, w that it was called free edging free edging meaning that you are painting your base nail and the back of your nail and like all over to have that secure um, top coat on it. So anyway, I have found the right product. Well, that's working for me. For the past two days, my nails have been looking like this. Not chipping. It's not peeling. It's, this is the longest my nail has, nail polish has stayed on my nails. It's amazing and I'm about to talk about that product review with you, but I'm going to let you know what the tools are that I am using. Now, as you know, if your hands in constant water for a long period of time, that's not good for your nail. It softens up your nail, and it's easier for your nail to break. So, um, one of the tools that I use, that I've always used since I can remember because I've always known that it's better to wear plastic gloves, like these, um, when you're washing dishes, because that's about the time when you mostly have your hands in water for a long period of time. So I always, always wear my handy trusty plastic gloves. This is key number one of keeping and growing long, healthy nails. My second thing is that I massage in my cuticles in my nail bed this herbal oil. Now as you know if you see my previous video I use this for my hair and um, at first I was using vitamin E and cuticle oil but then I was reading this herbal oil because this is such a great product that um, it says it conditions dry skin and cuticles. So I was like let me try this because it has ginseng and it has a lot of natural oils in it and um, I started rubbing the oil into my cuticles every morning, every night, and throughout the day. But I definitely make sure I do it every morning, every night. 
And what I do is I put a little bit in the palm of my hand, as you see, and I rub my hand a little bit, and I just rub my nails into the palms of my hands so that they get covered with the oil, as you see. And then what I'm going to do is um, one at a time, I'm going to massage this oil into my cuticles, focusing mostly in my cuticles. Cause cuticles get dried out, um, and also this oil, I'm noticing that not only is it conditioning my cuticles, I think it's conditioning my nails too because they don't seem as brittle as they used to feel. So I try to put this on all the time throughout the day. I think it's doing wonders for my nails. So as you see, I'm doing it one at a time. And once I complete it, I came across two products. Never heard of them before, never heard of the company, but I wanted to go out and find some kind of base coat and top coat that I was hoping would work. Like I told you, I tried Sally Hansen for some odd reason. It does not adhere to my nails. So I came across these two products yesterday. I went to my local BS. BSS, meaning my local beauty supply, beauty supply store or shop. And this is called Pro Nail Nail System. This is the base coat. It's a milky base coat. Um, the size is 2.5 ounces. It looks like this is the only size that they have. It doesn't come any smaller. And also I have the Quick Dry Top Coat, also by Pro Nail. 2.5 ounces. These bottles cost about these bottles cost 6.99 each, and I, I thought it was a pretty good deal because like the nail polish that I'm looking for, like with Sally Hansen, their prices range from 4.99 and up, and the bottles are much smaller than um, these bottles. So I I think I'm getting a great deal, and I think it's even a better deal if it's working. So I really don't worry about the price that I pay for something if it's showing me that it works. So um, I put this on first and it doesn't look milky on your nail but it's called a milky base coat because it looks milky in the uh, bottle. Then I put on the color. I'm going to show you the color I put on this week. I'm going to change my color like every week I think. And this is Pure Ice and the color is called Pure, pure Ice Splash. This is a really pretty color, as you see, nice blue color. And this has, like I said, been sticking to my fingernail for the past two days now. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to be putting this top coat on my nail every day. Now, I just started the, this process, like I said, this is my second day with, with it's on, and look at my nails, nothing's peeling. So that's what I'm going to be doing every day. I'm going to be putting a top coat, the top coat on it because the more layers you have, the more stronger and protected your nails are that they won't get weak so quickly in the water and everything. So, um, so far I like this product. So I'll continue to let you guys know about this product. But right now it's a thumbs up, thumbs up. So that's what I wanted to share with you to let you know what, what I'm doing with my nails now. And I'm very excited because they're looking beautiful. They're nice and short and even. Of course, I shaped them up. And you can see the back of the length. Like this hand is longer than this hand, but I'm sure there's a catch up. So I just want to show you the back of my nails. Let's just see how long they are or how short they are right now. And throughout the weeks, I will do an update, and you guys can see how they're growing. Now, um, since last week, I was doing the vitamin E and a cuticle oil on my nail every day, and um, I definitely saw the difference. So, like your hair, you have to keep it moisturized, and I believe, like it, like that, you got to do the same thing with your nails. Because if you don't, if you don't keep your hands moisturized, lotioned up, oiled up, of course your hands are going to get dry and your cuticles are going to get dry. You want to keep your cuticles moisturized because this is where your nail is growing from. So you got to keep it healthy too. So not only am I going to have healthy growing hair, I plan on having healthy growing nails. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it's helpful to someone who also is trying to grow nails and they can't. And I'll post Love for Nails um, 
website for you, I mean channel for you to check her out. She's awesome, awesome with um, tips and hints about growing long, healthy nails. So guys, you have a blessed day. Smooches.